come back. Sorry, the break took a little longer. I had a proper dinner, spent some time with the wife and the kids. And uh, let's go. Let's go again. Uh, we had two for Acker, so I loaded Acker, and now it's a tie. It's a tie now. Jemima and Acker tied at two apiece. So, should we play just with Acker, who's set up? I think we will. It's a tie, and since we have Acker, we're gonna give the nod to those who uh, voted first. <laughs> Hope that's okay with the guys who's, who voted for Jemima. Welcome, Rossman, Wreck for, Wreck for Life, uh, Chris Chow. Good evening, Alan and Zilke. Thanks for being here. Let's uh, start with Acker, the baby baby created last week. Pretty decent clubs, actually, pretty decent. Uh, mainly lacking a sniper um, for seven. I have a sniper three, not ideal. Not ideal, but I'm still going to play hole three with a sniper. I, I feel it gives me a, a, a better chance at the Albi on three, but it's going to be it's going to be tough. No doubt about it. But we'll have to, to play and do our best and see how uh, we end up. You know, that's there's some holes where we have to play differently with different clubs, mainly seven, where we'll have to use the Viper. Um, but it's okay. Randy and Frank, Bob Barker, welcome guys. Oh, 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 bad start already here, uh, great left. It's okay. 32, Stefan, uh, I don't think so. Not with Acker. I don't think it's gonna happen. Maybe with uh, Jemima. We shot a, a 32 with Jemima, but that's... <laughs> that was ridiculous as well. Timmy, plus 10 on the first one. Plus 10. Plus 10 for the drive from a max distance uh, with that club and that uh, ball. And the second shot, we'll play. Mid plus zero plus point four rings. Had we hit a perfect, had we hit a perfect, which we did not, we would have uh, played just a mid plus zero. But uh, we are now in, uh, we are now further away from the hole because of the great left. So even though the yardage is the same, the position we're at, uh, uh, we're, the position we're in is not. So I'm going to use mid plus zero plus 0.4, which is 1.7 rings. That's the adjustment here. We hit perfect. Let's see if that works from that position. It does right there. Boom. What a start right there. Nice. Nice. Randy, the Zerg shot on hole five. I don't have a Zerg shot in, on five, Randy. Uh, and I have, don't have any Zergs in, in Rookie. Was that in Pro? Maybe Pro in uh, hole six? Is that what you mean, Randy? I have the Zerg on six in Pro. Thanks for the booms there, uh, Bob, Zilke, Alan. Thank you, Stefan. Thank you, Rack, for life. Thank you, Timmy. That's how we want to start. Right there. So, the thing is, even though my guide says 20, 325 plus uh, yard drive uh, adjusted mid plus zero, that would be true had we hit a uh, perfect shot. But we hit great left, so we have 326 yards, but we are to the left, meaning we are still further away from the hole and that is why I use the same adjustment as if we hit like a 320 drive, perfect. Because we are further away from the hole, you know what I mean? I have not put that exact situation in the guide, but it's just something we have to think about. So yardage alone does not count. It's the position. So we are further to the left, meaning the yardage is no longer valid. 
Oh, the second part four, yeah, in pro. So six on pro, Randy. Yes, uh, uh, happy, happy for you, Randy. I'm glad that worked out. It's a dangerous approach, but it pays off. Even though I think we will always get eagle from the right hand side with a less dangerous drive. The reason behind me playing the Zerk approach on one is that we have an outside chance for hole in one which we don't have on the right hand side. That's the only reason why I put it in there. I think the risk is worth the reward. Thank you, Chris. Glad it worked out for you, Randy, because there's trouble there, even with the Zerk. It's not... You have to pull it off, so well played, Randy. Well played. A lot of stuff can go wrong there. And that's why I gave both options for those who who do want to play it a little bit safer. Thank you, Mick. How you doing? Time Lord. Look at that name. That's a cool name. Time Lord. <laughs> that's what I love about this game. We find... Uh, we get matched up with people with cool names. Sometimes they have cool clan names as well. Obviously, we have the uh, the standard names, some probably in bad taste, but sometimes we find gems, cool names. <laughs> I didn't pay attention to the wind. Uh, he has a nav, so that'll be the same. That is good, good wind. As I say in the guide, less than uh, 2.8 miles per hour, we use 0.5 left spin. Otherwise, we'll use 0.9. And in higher winds, 1.1 left spin, which is important after adjust. So, um, Timmy, this one, oh wow. This one I'll play max distance plus 25. Max distance plus 25, 3.8 back. Bounce on the fringe top of the fringe, aim straight at the hole. Aiming straight at the hole. It's kind of tricky sometimes with lower level uh, backbones, but yeah. And we're gonna add point, uh, 0.5 to the left. Max plus 25. Where is it? Oh my goodness. Is two rings. We still have time. Still have time for this. No worries. Hit perfect. And we don't. That's going to be right of the hole. What a shame. Just barely right. Perfect is in. Perfect is in. Yeah, exactly, Randy. If you don't feel safe with the short irons, go for the green. It's uh, safer that way. Salim, welcome. How you doing, Salim? Too busy watching me. I'm keeping you from playing. I'm sorry, Mick. <laughs> but still loads of time to play. I wish you good luck, Mick. I wish everyone good luck. Go out and crush it. <laughs> Wade, welcome. Yeah, perfect was in. It happens. <laughs> that we got a drop on one, so that's good. We're not all the way uh, behind here, so I can live with that. It's not the fast start, but this is Akka Heron we're talking about. It's uh, it's the baby created last week. I uh, got to forfeit this. Uh, good luck to you. Time Lord, good luck. And we move on to hole number uh, two, uh, three. Let's just uh, check my bag here. Uh, my... I'm gonna switch to the, the the sniper here, even though it's low level, and I recommend sniper um, four plus. And that's what I say in the guide, at least I think. Um, I'm gonna play it with the sniper because I believe I can still get it. Uh, we just have to use uh, a different landing spot. Because we don't have the backspin with the Sniper 3, so that's something to consider. We've got to be careful. 
Hey Nae, welcome. Yeah, I got a breather. I had a little longer break, about an hour. That was good. Spent some time with the family. Got some air. Chilled a bit. It was good. I mean, yeah. Probably wasn't the, good, the best idea to, to plan uh, five accounts in a row. We, you could all see I was slacking off there towards the end uh, with Jane. That wasn't uh, a very good round. It was all on me and um, lost focus a little, played poorly. So I thought a break would be uh, the way to go. Arno, welcome. How you doing? Thank you for the good luck. We had uh, one good round, one very good round and a bad round. Oh, we had four rounds. So we shot, what, what did we shoot? 28, 29, 31 and uh, 26 at the end. So yeah. No, Nicholas, two more. Uh, this one and uh, Jimmy Magina coming up. Mauro is back. Welcome. Thank you so much. Boa tarde. Obrigado. Thank you, thank you so much. Uh, 4.9 is a higher wind, though. Higher wind, but the QB6. Uh, usually I would push up, but with the higher wind, I don't think I'm going to. I'm not pushing up in higher wind. Still might have to. I said push back into max, but I'm just gonna push up like half a ring. Should do the trick without going too far. Okay, we hit perfect. Uh, this is important here because a great left would uh, probably have clipped the rough. And that should be fine. Um, 307. 304. Okay, 304 is perfect. Because we need a little more room uh, with the Sniper 3. We need to align it up uh, further back. We need to line it up further back because we don't have the backspin. So, uh, we'll see. It's not going to be that easy, Sniper 3, but uh, I feel it's going to be a better shot than with uh, the Viper. <laughs> yeah, family cheers things, uh, things up. But I didn't need to cheer up. You guys cheer me up all the time. I just probably needed uh, some, some time away from the screen. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to always uh, scream, uh, stream uh, six accounts. It was just, Akka was... We were doing so well with Akka Heron, the baby from last week. I thought it might be interesting for people to see me play with a, a week old account. So we'll see. As you can see here, we have a little more room. And that's all the backspin I have. That is uh, the problem here. So I have to line it up further back. We have three wind. This is usually where we want to bounce, but I'm going to pull it back a little. I'm going to pull it back so it lands on the fringe. Otherwise, we will never get it to stop and it might still come in hot. It might still come in hot. But I'm going to take that chance. Oh, we hit a great right. That's going to help. That's not going to help. Let's see how hot we are. We bounced on the fringe. That was good. Uh, perfect would have been online, but it would have been hot anyway. It's a very tough one to get this to stop with just one backspin. I think I'll probably have to go back to the Viper. Um, I haven't played it yet with the Sniper here, I think, so go back to the Viper. 100 plus games, is it? It is. That's a lot of games. <laughs> Welcome, McDilson. No notification again. That's unlucky. I thought that was finally uh, sorted out. Let's see what we can do with the juniors here. So we don't get the albatross here. Um, it's okay. With Acker, I don't necessarily... I don't think I made Albi here uh, once with Acker. Just... Um, Clubs are lacking. It's it's a problem, but it's okay. We need to get the drops elsewhere. 
Uh, Timmy, yeah, plus 10. The, the, the drive is plus 10. And the second is 0. Min plus 0 for the second. Max plus 10 for the first. Oh, no way. You dropped an NMT on hole 4. With a great left. With a great left. Nice, MacDilson. I love it. <laughs> uh, I don't care how we get the drops as long as they go in the hole. A little luck uh, can't hurt. As I said, better be lucky than good. <coughs> hole number four coming up. Let's see if we can drop it here with our navigator, Goliath. I'm going to play that max plus 15, Timmy. Max plus 15. And we have to line it up properly. And I have a uh, Goliath 4, and we actually did drop it uh, already with uh, Akka Heron. So I'm gonna use the exact uh, screenshot I had before. Max right, five and a half top, and set it up exactly the same. Oh, it was a great right. Okay, okay. That's good. It's nice to have a no-move target shot uh, in your bag. We, we had some in, in previous tournaments. I didn't play one here. Had I heard about it earlier, I might have. Sometimes there are NMT shots which are absolute money, and sometimes there are NMT shots that are a bit thickly. Oh, come on. Max right. Five and a half top. Aim it at the hole, and then now we're gonna move the target. To around here, 1.1 rings, max plus 15. We hit perfect, it's gonna be very, very close. We get the kick that's gonna go, no way! We did not get the full kick forward. What a shame, uh, that was right on line. Right on line, it lands like a millimeter uh, further to the... Uh, further ahead to the green. Uh, that's gonna get the kick and get in the hole. But a good shot. Yeah, exactly, yeah. If you don't get the shot to work, uh, you try something else. Hey, Robert, welcome. So, yeah, we're just missing the final kick forward that propels us uh, there to the hole. Next time we'll drop it. Oh, we're just going to drop the next one. This one, hole number five. We dropped that with Acker. <laughs> we dropped it already once today with the Horizon. I do have the Horizon 3, which... Funnily enough, I feel more comfortable with. My adjustment with the Horizon 3 is easier for me than with the Horizon 4, which has a, has a better ball guideline. I have no clue why. I keep dropping it with the 3 and missing it with the 4. Even though the adjustment is exactly the same. But we got super, super close uh, earlier with the 4 a few times. Nice name, nice! Very nice uh, name. Yeah, exactly. Mac McDilson. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I knew it was McDilson. Did I say something wrong? I misspoke. I misspoke. Okay, quarterback. It's quarterback six is a very decent club here. For a week old account. But any level quarterback will do. A 
so we play this max plus 10 and the next one will be max plus 0 295 perfect position for a drop here I tell you for a perfect position here oh really Hammer Hank is playing disc golf what's disc golf I never heard about that Uh, no, Alan, uh, uh, then you line it up wrong. Uh, I was talking about that earlier uh, in the pre previous stream. You need to pull it back. I'm going to show you right now for the second shot. You played it max distance, you're going to hit a bump and you're going to leave it short, Alan. Oh, Frisbee, really? Serge, welcome back, Serge. <laughs> so I'm going to show you right now uh, with the uh, four top and uh, two right. How we need to line it up exactly. So if we are in max distance here, you see the ball guideline on the fringe, it goes down. The little stump here. If we pull it back here, it jumps up right there. So we have to use it right here before the fringe that is where we want to bounce you can see that the pit uh, the tip pointing up that is the trick that is the trick right there otherwise you're going to be short we hit it perfect and that should come in at the perfect speed that should not be short gonna be a bit short oh what a shame that was right on line too why was that short maybe because we only had 2.7 wind that could have been it yeah when we dropped it we had three plus that could be the extra push here you did pull back so that's good but you know it's tricky Alan it's, a, it's still a tricky adjustment we cannot get it right all the time the horizon is not the uh, it's it's not the most reliable club, but at least we gave it a shot, you know. Thank you guys. Well, we didn't drop it, but it was a good shot. You bounced off the pin. How did you do that, name? Did you go uh, full speed? <laughs> Maybe I could have had the, the wind was a bit lower, like at just point one or point two topspin. Point one topspin would have been enough just to get the extra roll there. I should uh, pay attention to that next time uh, in lower winds. Still gonna play it like this in, in winds uh, 3 plus. But probably give it that extra little uh, top spin in winds lower than 3. Maybe. Oh, half is too much, name. Half is too much. Yeah, it looked nice, right? The line was uh, right there, it was right on point there. I believe uh, I had a tick more topspin, like 0.1 more, uh, that's in. We're gonna drop it on the back nine, guys. <laughs> Jens B. Uh, of course you did, of course you did. Welcome, Blankenstein. For those who don't know, don't know, Jens B is a big dog master. He likes the club. Heck, like is an understatement. He loves the club. He loves it. And he's a big dog beast. <laughs> exactly, otherwise it comes in too fast. A half a, a half top a half a top spin is too much, just like the tick. Like like four uh, point one top is gonna be enough. <laughs> Jens It will drop eventually Alan That's what I was saying about hole 5 All we can do is uh, knock on the door over and over again And then it might drop uh, one of those times It's not a sh You know Yeah if we had like a higher level club Like we play that hole in Rookie with a Sniper 10, we're gonna drop that every time. But we don't have those clubs in Rookie, so we have to make do with the Horizon. And uh, the fact that we can get it to drop with the Horizon is already uh, 
a huge advantage over the field uh, who cannot do that. Oh, okay. Uh, again, Titan. We only have an extra mile four. But that will not deter us. It will not. We have less uh, backspin than on the six. So we might run the risk of going long. It might happen. So I'm going to set up a little bit further in the bunker than I usually would with more backspin. Just because I want to get it to stop. And not roll over the green necessarily. So I, I hope it's going to stop. I'm going to go almost full uh, curl here. We have less curl than on other extra miles. The problem with the extra mile 4 is a, a great left or right will probably lead uh, to trouble because of the low accuracy. Oh wow, look at that. What a nice shot. That is the closest we've been. Look at that. Oh, just a tick less curl and uh, that's it. <laughs> Wayne Lilly is back. Welcome. How you doing, Wayne? Welcome, Dave. Uh, this is the second last one. So we are on the hole number six of our second to last account. Eka Heron now, the week old account, followed by Jimmy Magina. And that's going to be her fourth tourney. So she's about six, uh, seven weeks old. Thank you, Stefan. Yeah, Drew, right? Drew dropped it for a hole in one here. Drew dropped it. Was that a humble brag, Drew? A humble brag? Exclamation mark, Drew. The wonderful Drew IV. Part of Team Tommy Streamers. So, good try here. I'm happy with this one. Oh, you've had that wrench for a while. I haven't wrenched anyone in weeks. So you've got that a while ago, Timmy. <laughs> the thing is, yeah, the channel has been blowing up and I cannot wrench everyone anymore because I really have to rethink my wrench strategy. And that is no diss for anyone, you know, just... We can't be having hundreds of people wrenched. It's not gonna work out. I'm gonna lose oversight. So I will... I know you were messing with me, Drew. I know that. And that's why I love you guys. Of course I want you to mess with me. We're all here to have fun, right? The fun. Alright, we're gonna go uh, Viper. Um, what am I gonna do? Um... We can put the big dog in the bag here already for hole number nine. And then we're gonna put the Viper in here because we cannot play this hole. Oh, we got a, a pin chest, look at that. Another free chest, come on. What we can, we cannot get there with the, we don't have the backspin for the uh, the sniper here. It's uh, no way, no way we can play with the, the sniper. So we have to play with the Viper. And it's gonna be harder. No doubt about it, it's gonna be harder. But we can still drop this. Three back, one and a half left. I'm gonna check my Viper uh, screenshot. Hey, welcome, Rock. No, it's not the last one. Second to last one. We're gonna play with uh, Jimmy Magina later. The second baby. Three back. Oh, and this is high wind. This is. And on this account, I do not have the uh, wind balls here so back here i want to get the kick to the the kick to the hole that's gonna be around here the problem is the problem is first of all i have the wrong bag in here 1.9 rings and we have to go into underpower 
uh, which is gonna make this very tricky. Oh no, we do not. That was lucky. Barely not into underpower. So let's see how we uh, play this with the uh, the Viper. We get it in the hole. We got the kick we wanted right to the hole there. Boom! Oh, isn't this fun, guys? Uh, Mix starting pro tomorrow. I'll be starting pro um, probably when Matthew is on the uh, back nine. So a little earlier than today. I anticipate around um, 10.45 Central European time. Thank you, Wayne. Thank you, Alan, Stefan, Mick. Thank you, Rock, Robert, and Zilke, Johnny. <laughs> yes, I'll do a replay, Wayne. Thank you, Naeem. Thank you, Timmy. I didn't see you come in, Johnny Tink Tink. Welcome, Johnny Tink Tink. How you doing? Thank you, Timmy, and thank you, McDilson. So, Timmy, this was min plus 10. Min plus 10. Thank you, Blankenstone. The screenshot of that is also in the guides. Because I did sync it with Acker in the uh, qualifying rounds. This is absolutely uh, awesome. I like it. I'm gonna uh, do the replay. We've hold it lots of times with the sniper, but it's just tougher with the Viper. So it's the exact same shot we play with a sniper, but we have to imagine how the ball guideline uh, goes to the hole. Thank you, Blankenstein. Thank you, Mauro. Thank you, Obrigado. So min distance, plus 10. Three back, one and a half left. And now we aim at the hole, but the, the green slopes can you see that little tip? It slopes to the left and to the right. So we have to imagine how the ball goes, reacts along that line. So you can see the tip is a little bit left of the flag. That's because the roll is a little bit to the right. And we line it up. The second bounce is at the start of the green, just behind the fringe. Because that gives us the kick forward. Look at where the ball lands. It kicks forward. If we are a little bit further down, the ball stops dead. But we need that kick right there from the fringe. And that will get that kick from the fringe by lining up just behind the fringe. And then not pushing up for adjustment. So we land on the fringe, get the kick towards the hole and go in. And that is important. We really need that kick. Otherwise, we stop dead. We land it on the green, the ball stops. We land it on the fringe, it kicks forward. I hope that explanation makes sense to you. I hope you get it. <laughs> oh, Caden. Well, hello, but unlucky. Come on. Get it done. It can always go better. And if not, you know, we all have crap rounds from time to time, Caden. So don't get uh, disheartened. Uh, you can only do better, you know. <laughs> exactly, like Mick says, uh, keep persevering. Caden, I don't know if you need help. I don't know if you've seen the guides. If you need the help from the guides, they are available to everyone. Alright, we need to... Think of something here. Hole number eight. You can't get it in in pro, uh, blanket stun. I have got a perfect shot in pro. The perfect adjustment now in the updated guides. Is that not working out for you, blanket stun? Because we've been dropping that uh, without fault with that adjustment in pro. Hey, Caden, you know, don't give up. But if you want to have a look at the guides, download them from the website. They are free. Maybe it'll help. Maybe. 
You know, what do you have to got what have you got to lose, Caden? What have you got to lose? And also just take a break and continue tomorrow maybe. Continue tomorrow maybe. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna first have a look about uh, the distance I need of the uh, Backbone 9 compared to Backbone 7. Ah, Backbone 7 is not good. I need 7 yards. I have a horizon though. That's not gonna help either. Even with an upgrade. Otherwise, I have the Grim Reaper. I'm gonna use the Grim Reaper. It has a better ball guideline, so that's what I'm gonna use. The big dog, we don't need it for this hole anyway, so it does not matter. So I'm gonna use Grim Reaper. Because I need the distance for the uh, rough bump coming up. Because I'm playing the rough bump, I'm gonna play with the navigator. So that's where uh, it comes in, you know, I need the distance for the second shot. Uh, Blankenstein, try it. Nothing to lose, right? Caden, I hope, uh, I'm gonna hope, uh, hope you're gonna make it, Caden. And if you're feeling, you know, like, like frustrated and feel like giving up, just take a break. Step away from the game for a while and uh, come back uh, motivated. Hey, Nicholas. <laughs> Okay, now I get to taste. Ted Cashy, 30 under and rookie, awesome. Oh, thank you, Chris Chow. Thank you so much. Exactly, random guy, that's so true. Alright, kids are going to bed. Mr. Magoo, welcome. It's going really well now, really well. I'm really happy. You've dropped hole two, finally. Well done, Takashi. Awesome. So we need to get as far down this fairway, but the problem here is with the extra mile four, we cannot hit great left or great right. The accuracy does not allow for it. So we need to hit perfect. Otherwise we're gonna clip the rough and be short and cannot play the rough bump. And if we go long and go in the rough, we also cannot play the rough bump, but this is perfect. This is the distance we need. So we can play the rough bump with our um, Grim Reaper. <laughs> Welcome, Jeffrey. So uh, this one also plus 10 for the first shot and plus 10 for the second shot. Ingrid, how you doing? Welcome, Ingrid. Uh, Blankets on hole one. I don't play a rough bump. Hole one, I uh, just bounce it before the uh, the fringe. And hole two, I do use a rough bump, but uh, what clubs do you have, Blankenstein? Because the rough bump is with a Goliath, uh, and any level Goliath will do. Any level Goliath uh, will do. What Goliath do you have, Blankenstein? Oh, no way, it went in the water. Unlucky. Oh wow, Dave, yeah. This is a great age. They're nine and 11. My daughter's 11, my son is nine, and you know, they're still kids, 
but it's not gonna last very long, so I have to uh, savor the moment, you know. I'm pretty sure you know exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, we need a little overpower. This is not recommended, but I'll do it anyway. <laughs> I'll do it anyway. Uh, this one is a toughie. We uh, do not have enough distance for the Grim Reaper 3, so I want to land it here. Meaning I'll uh, adjust into overpower, adjust for the shot. I need 1.6 rings here. Trying to pull with the arrow. Let's see. Don't do this at home. Uh, we hit great left and uh, that is uh, not gonna go in, but it's okay. A perfect might have had, had a shot. Same thing as with on hole seven. Where we want to bounce, we get a kick forward. We got a bad bounce now because of the great left and um, didn't go in, so you know. Oh, Bunker, Nicholas Bunker was never in play here. Never in play. <laughs> Tom McDonald, welcome. Uh, that music is uh, a band called Psycho Toaster. It's their debut album. And their singer, single is called Toasted. And that's how I got to know them. They gave me permission to use their songs on the stream. It's uh, Their debut album was released about uh, uh, a month ago. Five weeks ago. And I love that uh, album. I, I, I think it's fantastic. Why am I making you stress, Stefan? Because of dangerous shots like that? <laughs> Nicholas K, thank you so much for stopping by today. Good luck to you as well. I hope uh, you play well. So we're gonna go max back here. Um, it's the same shot we played earlier. So usually we would go three back. It's gonna be max plus 10, the adjustment and full curl to the left. So this is just to show you that even with an extra mile four, you can still play the same shot. We adjust into the trees, uh, it doesn't matter because of the curl. And we end up perfectly down the fairway, can play a safe second shot with our uh, big dog. We'll always make eagle here. It's a very simple drive. We are a bit shorter here because the extra mile four doesn't, doesn't have that much distance, but that's why we have the big dog. So the second shot will be minus 10%. 10% uphill, meaning minus 10%. <laughs> Naeem, can you see this message? I can see the message. Oh, it's on me. Let's see what we can do here. We don't really have the backspin here. So I need about a half a ring of overpower here. Or a ring, maybe. So I'm gonna push back into the adjust. And now we just play um, Without overpower. Uh, what did I miss? What did I miss? Oh, there were loads of messages. What did I miss there? Uh, oh, use the Viper 9, then the sniper, so pull less rings for hole not a 7. What sniper name? What sniper? Because the pull is going to be the same. I prefer the sniper. You have a better ball guideline. It's more accurate. 
Blankenstein has Goliath 5. That's gonna be fine. I dropped it with the Goliath 5, uh, Blankenstein. Robert Desmond, the secretary of the 19. What else did I miss here? I missed a lot of stuff. Sorry, guys. It's hard to keep up with chat at times. So, okay, I'm gonna make the eagle here. And then we're gonna see. Okay, nice. We got that. Hey, Vape, welcome. So I'm catching up on chat, Vape. Welcome, Vape Bomb. <laughs> so was that the, 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 the Sniper 7? Okay, uh, Naeem, Sniper 7 is perfect. Go with uh, Sniper 7. I wouldn't think twice about it. Sniper 7 is perfect, Naeem. Perfect. Oh, wow. Unlucky. Okay, we get the Eagle 15 under for Aka Heron for the front. That is awesome. Awesome. Uh, Naeem, uh, not Naeem. Yeah, Naeem. Um, I played it with the Sniper 7 with uh, Mrs. Purchase with uh, Jane Plough. Bill Purchase uh, sunk it twice, I believe. Uh, no, Blair Toast. Blair Toast sunk it twice. That was Sniper 6, you know. And I got distracted here because I just saw now I missed the donation, but that was a while ago. Uh, and I didn't see him in chat at all. Stan Blueberry. Stan Blueberry. I don't know if he's in the chat. He said he would be lurking, but I did not see the donation pop up. So Stan Blueberry, if you're here, give me a sign so I can play you the donation gopher. <laughs> Anyway, thank you so much. If you ever rewatch this, uh, I really, really appreciate it. And uh, next time we see each other live, please say hi in chat so I can play you the donation gopher. 15 under, I'm happy with this, very happy. So we got one, the drop on one, the drop on six, and the drop on seven. Uh, very happy with that. Yeah, show some love for Stan Blueberry right there. I'm gonna take a, a short break. I'm gonna go kiss the kids goodnight in their beds. That's what they we, uh, were asking about, which I will, of course, do. And uh, I'll be back in a few minutes.
Right, we're back. Robert Desmond is out. Thank you for stopping by, Robert. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. I hope to see you soon. GC Robert on Facebook. Good. Uh, the second shot, Timmy. Uh, which which hole? On which hole? Here we only need extra marlin thorn, so I'm gonna leave that bag as it is. We don't need anything else. Okay, kids are tucked in. Let's start strong again. Oh my god, Team Toast is blowing up. I missed a lot of messages. We'll have to review them later or tomorrow morning. If anybody was waiting on an answer. Oh wow, unlucky there. What a waste of a Zerk. What a waste of a Zerk. Unlucky uh, he, he caught the rough there. Otherwise that might have had a shot. High wind though, high wind. I'm gonna line it up further back, just to be safe. Uh, I don't want to roll into the rough here. That's very high wind in rookie. We hit perfect this time, so let's see here. Well, that should be around 320-ish. 321, good. Yeah, Timmy, what uh, what hole for the what second shot? Which hole uh, are you asking about the sniper? What uh, level sniper on which hole? Second shot, which hole? Oh, on hole nine. It's a tough one. I would say at least seven. At least seven. And you really need to pull off a, a perfect drive for that. The distance we had, we would not be able to reach with a sniper. You can... Um, what you can do is uh, play a power uh, four ball or even a zerk and then you will be uh, could reach. But otherwise it's going to be very tough with a titan uh, to reach. And anything below uh, a 7 will not give you the uh, the ball guideline. Which you'll need. And uh, the bunker is in play. As are the trees. So I would not play it with anything less than a 7. Oh, great left. Oh, crap. It's got to be just left. Perfect is in. Perfect is in. That's a shame because this, for my level clubs, this is the most gettable. Should have made that. What was that? That was weird. That must have been a glitch. So, Timmy, yeah. You can play it with a 7, uh, but I would play safe and uh, use a power 4 ball for that. Because if you land your drive short and you're around the 290 mark, where I, wish I just was, uh, you're not going to reach. That is my take on that. And you don't want to overpower the sniper. I'd rather play a, a, a big dog without, without overpower than a sniper with overpower. Just to be uh, safe.
Okay, back bow navigator just like last time. Hope for a favorable wind. Um, hit perfect this time. <laughs> we already missed the drop here on uh, 10 by not hitting perfect. I'm not gonna give me a slap for that. That wasn't that bad a miss. Otherwise, you'd see slaps from the gophers left and right all the time. <laughs> uh, 3.1 is good. Wind, I like it. Uh, 3.8 back. We line it up at the hole on the fringe. Top of the fringe here. Aim it straight at the hole. And we use 0.9 left spin now. Just a tick less than uh, one left. 3.1 plus 25. Oh my goodness. Um, wrong bag. It's a rush adjustment. I need to get it off. Oh, I'm so dumb. This deserves a slap right there. Toast! You are the worst! <coughs> now focus and get your act together, Toasty. Set up your bags in your caddy app before playing the hole. I cannot repeat myself enough because we are making this mistake all the time. Everybody's been there. Everybody's uh, going to be there in the future. It's just so frustrating. We lost valuable time. We had to rush it. Uh, Mo! Uh, some good, some bad. Uh, the bad was a 26 with Jane. The good was a 31 with uh, Blair, I believe. Oh, we have to putt. Okay, let's focus now. Let's focus. Come on. Come on. We need a few more drops. Uh, we missed uh, very good chances here. Very good chances down the drain because I didn't pay attention. <laughs> Timmy, enjoy your shower. <laughs> oh, no, Wayne. Yes, exactly. It happened to us earlier. We missed the hole in one on seven because of that. Adjusting for power three ball when we used a power zero ball and uh, we were point one off and it was sitting on the on the edge of the cup So that would have been in had I adjusted for power three ball But now I, I had the wrong bag and I didn't find the right bag straight away mm, Good luck to you. I like golf from Great Britannia, okay we're gonna play the Viper this time, uh, Sniper. I would prefer the Sniper, but we need level four plus. We don't have it, so. Nice, 28 in Rookie. With a par, with a par and no drops on one. Mo, that is an excellent score there. Yeah, right, Mick. When was that? Uh, yesterday, I believe. Yesterday in pro opening, uh, I did that for like eight holes. And I was talking about it with Drew. Yeah, you know when you have the wrong uh, bags? Uh, and it took me eight holes to notice that I was playing with the wrong bags. It had the same clubs, but different levels. And, uh, <laughs> and then I could understand. Then I finally understood why I kept missing all those. That was so stupid. Eight holes it took me yesterday. I, I don't know who it was with. I believe it was with uh, Clem, if I'm not mistaken. I used Toast's uh, maxed clubs instead of uh, Clem's not maxed clubs. And that was so stupid. Even talking about it, it was, it was like, come on, we've been talking about this for, for 10 minutes now. And that's when I noticed. 
vape. Yes, that's right. What's the yardage here? 304. Okay, good. Thanks for dropping the command, Nick. Very fast command drop. Thank you. Peter, welcome. You ma you managed to miss me all day. I'm here. I'm going to be here all day tomorrow. We've had success and we've had not. So 26 with Jane was uh, disappointing. And 31 with Blair was uh, fantastic. So I was really happy with that. We shot 15 under now with Acker. Happy with that, but no drops on the back nine so far. Acker Heron is the account I created last week. So I need uh, two more drops, except for six. So three more drops total to get to the 30 under. That would be cool. We also shot a 29 with Bill. That was also very cool. I like that. And something is up with the app. We had a few funky uh, shots from opponents where I think it's going to be... It's about glitches. So we have the Viper. We have now the min distance adjustment. Min plus zero. And it's just trickier to find the funnel here with the Viper. So I'm going to focus on the landing spots. Because we don't have the ball guideline. Which means two left, three back. So at least we have the backspin. This is min. Just so I know. And I want the second bounce here to be on that uh, dark triangle. You see that dark triangle, the half square? So I want it to be to the right side of that. That is where we should get the second bounce. Uh, we're a little bit short, so I'm going to adjust uh, a little more. So one and a half rings here instead of complete min. And hopefully we catch the funnel here blindly. Uh, that's all we can do without a ball guideline. Just uh, focus on that landing spot and catch the funnel. And very, very close, but no cigar. Close, but no cigar. Still a good try. I have not made Albi on this hole with Acker uh, all week. Because it is tougher with lower level clubs and no ball guideline. But we can get very, very close. And this was not a bad effort. Oh, Mo, yeah. But I enjoy playing and I enjoy streaming and both together are just uh, awesome. Actually, I, I prefer playing um, wild streaming. Uh, that's a shame. What's he doing? He's giving up on the eagle completely, on the Albi completely. Why do you play a shot like that where you have no shot at the hole? It's not about getting it to green. It's a shame. He was in between clubs, granted, but take the shot that at least has a chance to get in the hole. Haha, <laughs> Nick K, good question. I have a fantastic wife and very great children. But at the moment I'm streaming more because we're on lockdown for the past five weeks and it gives me something to do and something else to think about. I still play, uh, spend plenty of time with them, though. I mean, it's going to be alternate weeks. It's uh, turning week and then off week I take it uh, a lot slower and we spend a lot of time together. And yes, a very understanding wife. So I will not be streaming that much. That's the uh, the playoff, yeah. When the lockdown is over, wife is back to work. Uh, at the moment, there's Easter holidays as well. Even though it doesn't make much difference, but at least uh, I mean, if they, if it's not holidays, the kids have homework to do. They get it via uh, computer, uh, e-learning, all that stuff at the moment but uh, it's the last weekend of the school holidays so in theory monday school starts but of course it doesn't it's 
schools, primary schools open only in about five weeks here. So they're gonna be at home a lot. A lot, a lot. Oh, awesome, Stefan. You got hold to intro. Fantastic. Glad to hear it. <laughs> I'm still on top chat. That's why I'm missing so many messages. So if I missed anyone, sorry. I had top chat on, uh, which is uh, not good. So five and a half top. Max plus 25. Aim at the hole. And now we aim about a square to the right. Max plus 25, 2.3. It's easier with a, a higher level Goliath, but we'll give it a try again. We get the kick, but we adjust it too far to the right. What a shame. Thank you, Mick. Thank you, Mo. Mo, a uh, change on hole seven uh, in in pro. Yes. <laughs> no random guy. No, no. Uh, the clock has uh, been like that forever. Um, now it's become kind of a running gag here uh, in, in the stream. Uh, that clock has been uh, not working since I started streaming three months ago. So uh, I just refer the, to this as the stream where time stands still. And now I'm not going to change the batteries <laughs> just because of that. <laughs> yes, in pro, uh, I didn't change much. But I integrated the uh, adjustment, uh, the ring adjustment, which didn't work out. So now we use uh, the adjustment where we don't have to pull push up. So which is mid plus 10 plus 0.1 ring. And that works perfectly every time, uh, Mo. I did post the tweak, the suggested tweak, I believe yesterday morning. And now I've updated the, the hole completely, so it's the only adjustment that's in the guide, because it's money. It's always 10 past 10, yes. Oh, that's true, it'll be right in 10 minutes, Mick. Nice. Dane, uh, the babies, Akka Heron, uh, decent start, 15 under. No, actually, great start, 15 under front. But no extra drops on the back nine so far. And we still have Jimima Jima to play. So I'm not too unhappy about this. This is Aka Heron's first full tournament. And for that he's doing splendidly. He's look, uh, looking like a top 10 um, in the first full tourney. Um, which is all, uh, awesome. Awesome. We're not there yet. We're not there yet. But uh, let's see how we can end up here with Aka Heron in his first tournament. Yeah, you gotta try it, Mo. I sunk it like that. It's money. If you have a wind ball, spend it because then it's even more money. <laughs> also, for those who do not know, um, if you go to the website, check out the guides guide. Have a look at it. It just tells you how to adjust for different level clubs different level balls, different ball stats, how to um, adjust for, for the spin if you're not in the same distance as me of your club, if you're playing it from max distance of your club instead of mid. You know, just general stuff you have to pay attention to. Make the tweaks and uh, you get the most out of it. I'm not gonna say it's gonna work wonders, but it's gonna help and you might maybe learn a thing or two and in the future just make these adjustments all by yourself and it's definitely going to improve your score i'm pretty sure of that
Perfect. Let's see what the distance is here. 295 would be absolute money. And that is a perfect line. 293 is nice. I like it. I like it. We're going to go straight for the hole. Hopefully not. Uh, we have to check the wind. The wind is better this time. A lot, of, a lot better. So I don't need to be uh, more than... Uh, I don't need uh, the, more than the four top spin. We should have used four and a click because we had low wind last time. But in this win, the four will be enough. You've been working so far, Mo. Yes. No rush. You still have uh, a whole day and more to play. So two right, four top. is the adjustment here we're gonna go left a little left of the flag pull back so that the tip of the ball guideline goes from flat to up and that is where we want to be pretty much 1.6 rings A great right. Oh, what a shame. That's going to miss to the right of the hole. Speed is good. Speed is good. Perfect speed. Perfect speed, but it's not in. But that's the trick with that spin. Do not go max distance. Pull it back before the fringe so that the ball guideline points up and not flat. And that's going to give you the right kick towards the hole. We've dropped it, uh, this a few times, but I say it's a bonus. It's a definite bonus with the horizon, but at least we're going to give it our best uh, shot. So we can drop it with the horizon with a little luck because we don't have the, uh, the full ball guideline, but it's good enough so we know exactly where to aim. Yeah, absolutely. But we've dropped it, I think, three times. this week uh, in rookie like that so um, I really like it oh no 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 oh Joe yeah I feel you there feel you there I messed it up with Jane Pluff earlier good tiebreaker and uh, totally uh Trapped out just now earlier the round I played before with the 26 under Yeah, Chad, right? Depends on the sniper though, but yeah, I I Feel the horizon gives me the best uh, Idea how to hit it. I, I Feel the the ball guideline of the sniper is gonna be misleading No opponents. How is that possible? Ah, and quality, nice. Hey, still nice. Mikael, the two strokes. Ah, oh, Joe, yeah, I did that too today. I did that too. I said, oh, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna go for safe eagle. And then I, I still went for an unlikely albatross and it ended up in the sand. What are we good? What are we to do? <laughs>
Okay, bunker. We're gonna play this the same way. We don't have all the the backspin. Well, I'm gonna try to get uh, in the same here. So a little bit further down the bunker here. So just we get it to stop earlier. Max plus 10, 1.6 rings. And I'm gonna use even less curl because we have more wind to the right. So I'm gonna use about this amount of curl. And let's hope uh, we get a favorable bounce. Uh, that looks like it's gonna be short. Wow. Second time that happens to me with a perfect here. Exactly, Joe. Take a break, cool off before the round. Absolutely. So important. Adam Tinker, welcome. So we have to save this one. A uh, very crucial save coming up here. Crucial save. Funnel, that is right, Mick. We're gonna look for the funnel. Even though we missed the, uh, it with the funnel earlier. Um, Here we go, here we go. Funnily, 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 funnily. Great right. Uh, we still might catch the funnel with a great. No, we don't. Ah, oh, we don't. Weird though, because I felt I had enough room there. Enough wiggle room. And that a great right should have dropped from there. It is what it is. Slacking off on the back nine. What are you gonna do? So now we have to drop uh, hole two again, uh, hole seven. Can we drop it again here with the Viper? Uh, now we really need it. But you know that, uh, what that means. If we need it, we're not gonna get it. No, I'm not, I'm not gonna think that way. I'm not gonna think that way. I'm gonna focus on the hole in one. Ah, so angry, so angry at not catching that funnel. Can you tell how angry I am? <laughs> that was a very stupid miss. Uh, not the nav, but the marlin. We're ready. Ah, oh, a pube short. Unlucky. We need some luck there with the horizon shot, uh, no doubt about it. But we have to make our lo own luck, that's what I'm saying, you know. We have to be prepared and give it a shot. Knock on the door, make our own luck, and at some point it'll drop. The oik. Boom shanker. Oh, that is high wind. That is the highest wind. That is so unlucky, guys. That is, we're gonna get the highest wind. Meaning, we have to adjust into under power. We're gonna be less than min distance. This is the toughest shot of all, and I did not buy any um, wind five power zero balls, not with this account. So we dropped it on the front and I believe this is, I'm not going to say it's impossible to be dropped, but it's going to be very, very hard, very hard. 
in that wind. That is ugly. This is the worst you can get. So I'm going to set it up. This is where we get the push. 2.2 rings is the adjustment, which is gonna be impossible. I know that. A little bit to the left, and now we need to underpower it. And uh, hope for the best. Good try, good try, but it's a shame. Oh, just a bit too much to the left. Maybe a tick more on the power. But it's a tough shot in that wind. Thank you, Mick. Thank you, Nick. And this is, I, I'm going to tell that, uh, I'm going to say it again. And this is not about complaining, not saying, uh, it's rigged, blah, blah, blah. No, not at all. I'm just saying it is very unfair in Rookie when um, some people get a wind of two and others get a wind of five. So you can say, yeah, but it's only three miles per hour difference. Yeah, five mi miles per hour, that's not a high wind. But it's all about relation. Uh, so a five mile power wind is two and a half times the uh, the wind of the other person, uh, some somebody else. So somebody else gets two wind. It's it's an easy hole in one. Somebody gets five, and it's a hard hole in one. In the same division, and you will never see that relation. For instance, in masters. You would never see, for instance, a uh, somebody get a 14 mile per hour wind in Masters and the other person getting a, uh, a 35 mile per hour wind in Masters because that's the exact same relation, 14 and the other guys get 35. That's the same as 2 and 5. You know what I mean? You don't see those discrepancies and I think it's highly unfair in Rookie. Not to complain, not to whine, um, just want to put it in relation. So I don't know what you think about that, but that's actually how I see it. And often it does not really make a difference, but on holes like these and a couple of turnies ago where you could play the rough bump from the left was exactly the same problem. We get a high wind, we have trouble, we get a low wind, it's a certain ace. Oh, Ignacio, uh, it's money uh, in lower winds. And that's how we play this, uh, the rough bump there. It's a very uh, safe uh, hole in one. We hold it uh, over and over again. But as soon as you get very high wind and you have to uh, adjust into under power, it, it becomes tough. Okay, why do I use a uh, katana now, you might ask? Because we've been playing this with a quasar. Just because I was so uh, close to our max distance, I was slightly into overpower earlier with my um, Grim Reaper, which I have no alternative to. That I'm now playing a power a two ball, just to not having to adjust into overpower. And that's the only reason why. We were a, bit, a tad bit short. <laughs> like it doesn't make sense not getting APOC cards. Perfect drive. <laughs> yeah, but you know, you're not thinking uh, buying wind balls in Rookie. That's what I mean. Because the Rookie players, they don't want the wind five balls. Rookie players want the uh, power five balls. It's the Masters players that want the wind five power zero balls. Every uh, Masters player is like, oh, I so disappointed this is a bundle because I want the the season 21 ball 
and every Wookiee is like, oh, I'm so so unhappy this is a bundle because I want uh, the rock and roll ball. I don't care about the other ball. <laughs> and I think that's exactly why they bundled them, so it's, it's something for everyone. <laughs> Uh, I don't think so. I don't think they're going to be consistent for a bracket. And now we have low win, see? So uh, we have to make the most of this and drop this. Uh, still, it's going to be very, very hard because of our lack of ball guideline. We need the kick forward, which should be around here, but I cannot be certain. It's easier with, with a better club. Uh, we don't have to push up here, I believe. And a great left is not going to help. Unless we line it up wrong. But no, we didn't. I'm not saying a perfect is in, but it would have been, had a better cho a shot. Ignacio. Even for me, that type of hole becomes difficult. I'm not the best player out there, Ignacio. But yeah, it is going to be difficult. Yeah, if we have to underpower. I want to stay away from underpower. I want to stay away from overpower if I can. And I want to stay away from curl if I can. If I want to go for the hole. Because these three factors are making it so that it's going to be very, very hard to get an exact replica of your shot. Uh, to line it up and get it into the hole consistently. These three things are the, the most common source of error. Because side spin, we can adjust uh, perfectly. Top and back spin adjust perfectly. If we can line it up at uh, max distance, mid distance, we can replicate that each and every time. But as soon as we have to use underpower, overpower, or curl, it's gonna be very tough to replicate. Hey Chuck, welcome back. The yardage I'm looking for on hole 5. In rookie name, I'm looking for 295. Of course, it's the Wallace that matter. And um, I'm not going to get mad about that because it's company. It's, it's, it's normal. I d wouldn't expect anything else, honestly. <laughs> yeah, Mo, that's, yeah, with the Apex, yeah. I mean, on some accounts I got lucky, on some accounts I didn't. Hey, Jaime, welcome. How you doing, Jaime? Ah, <laughs> McDillson. <laughs> you went on the bunker on hole 7. I can have a look, McDillson. Do you want me to have a look here on stream? We are on Team Toast. I can have a look on stream, other, unless you don't want to show it. We can uh, walk through this together. But I'm not going to show it if you don't want to, uh, McDilson. Uh, 301, uh, it's probably too far, Naeem, because 301 is only possible and uh, with the trees in the way, I believe. I don't think you can get a clear line at 301. You're going to be too far to the right. And then you need curl to get around the trees, and as I just explained, curl is gonna destroy our uh, perfect adjustments. 29 on both. Uh, excellent, Jaime. Excellent. McDilson says it's okay, so we're gonna have a look at McDilson's shot on 7 to see if he did anything wrong. I hope I find something wrong with the shot. I mean, that would be ideal, right? To, to find something that... Uh, because no, we shouldn't be pushing up. So let me have a look here, McDilson. I'm gonna focus real hard. Anybody else has an idea and say anything? Oh, you used the Season 21 ball. That is very nice. Awesome. So three back, one and a half left. That's already too much left, McDilson. Less left. Less left for starters. One and a half. And that is more that is closer to two. Now the lineup. Uh, 
I can't really see the lineup. I have to watch it again. Gotta watch it again. So yeah, one and a half left. Uh, yes, it is, uh, Ignacio, at the moment. But I'm, I'm trying to make uh, some room. I'm going to move some of my accounts out. Uh, can you see you have too much left? You have a Sniper 6. Uh, that is uh, good. Because we dropped it with the Sniper 6. Now I can see your adjustment. It's going to the hole. Uh, I have to count the rings. Do you know how many rings you adjusted for the 2.2? 2.4? Should be around 1.8, 1.9 rings. It looks like one point looks like two rings you adjusted if I'm correct was that two rings I think it's two is that right McDilson two rings you adjusted let me just check the adjustment here I dropped it with uh, I think it was Blair Blair with the uh, six sniper Blair with a 6 sniper, min plus 10, and the wind was 2.4. Should be exactly two rings. So two ring adjustment is right. Two ring adjustment is right, if I'm not mistaken. I'm gonna have a look at it once more. So... I'm gonna have a very uh, uh, good look. The problem is uh, the too much left spin. If you have a good look at the, the rough line here, so you're gonna come in from uh, further to the left, which means you're already further down because the rough here on the on the left hand side, it's gonna go uh, a little up. Uh, so you should have lined up a little a bit further to the left with uh, 0.23 left spin less, meaning you have more room there to the rough so you're lining up higher and I still cannot say exactly but it looks like two rings and also yes it's slightly underpowered indeed you're clipping the the triangles meaning you are slightly underpowered so I think it's just a, a um, how do I say that uh, say that and then addition of a few very minor mistakes which by themselves probably won't be that noticeable but by combining them you get the sand is what I believe so I don't think you should give up on the shot and um, I believe it's just that and I hope you're gonna nail it on the back Chris Chow adjusted max instead of min. I feel you there. I feel you. I've been there. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry to laugh, but it just brings back memories, Chris. It brings back memories. Doing silly stuff like that. And those who've been uh, with me from the start of my streaming career, which was like three and a half months ago, you've seen some weird stuff. I've did some stupid ass mistakes which make for funny viewing but for heavy gopher smacks <laughs> oh random okay interesting the problem is if you're just for something else because of fear of something then you have to fear another thing you know what I mean so you're just uh, switching out a great left for a great right. The best advice for a rookie player is, first of all, learn the wind ring system. It is crucial. Um, you will not... You will not be able to compete consistently 
if you do not know the wind wind ring systems. Yeah, a gap. Uh, we've done that slide under power or slide over power so many times. It's so frustrating when that has an incidence on your shot. It does make feel uh, make you feel like an idiot. You've all seen me many times. I said, "What did I do wrong?" And then somebody in chat immediately slide under power, slide over power. It's like, ah, oh, not again. <laughs> Uh, no, Ginger. No, no, no. I've got another account uh, coming up. I'm gonna play with uh, Jimmy Magina, the own, uh, the other baby here. So um, I'm just gonna play this exactly the same. Plus 10, 1.6 rings-ish. We don't have to be as precise here. Uh, usually it's 3 back, but I say max because it's my extra mile 4. There it is, max. And now we just go for the green in two, for an easy eagle. This is always coming up uh, at the top shelf here. Any level extra mile is good. Yeah, exactly, Drew. Aaron gone killer, welcome. Yeah, stronger glasses, Chris, absolutely. So I don't know, uh, Ignacio, do you know the wind ring system? If you do, I can tell you other stuff. If you don't, you have to check up on the wind ring system. Uh, that is so crucial. Maybe, uh, Drew, if you could be so kind and drop uh, a link in the chat about the wind ring system for the people who do not know that. Uh, either uh, RJs or Tommies, I don't know. Exactly, a series of inconvenient events. It's what happens. That is why. If we uh, feel too safe with this game, it's gonna uh, it's gonna kill us. You're almost done with it. Good. Because and then you have to practice it. <laughs> that's that's the other thing, right? We have to practice it. Can I go for Albi here? Can I? You know what? Let's go for the Albi here. It's gonna be very tough here. Very tough. I'm gonna play a very, very risky shot. It's all risk. Don't try it at home. Really great right. We get away with it. <laughs> Turned out fine. Turned out just fine. <laughs> <coughs> Oh, thank you so much. Thank you, Jens, for dropping the links. Thank you, Joe. Thank you, Drew. Thank you so much, guys, for helping me out. Awesome, Peter. 30, uh, 28. Fantastic. I hope it holds for you, buddy. I hope it holds. It's, uh, it's a good thing to be in the clubhouse lead, for sure. A great shot, right? <laughs> Better than great left, because great left is bunker here uh, with that risky shot. Hey Chris, the board PC guy. Welcome, how you doing Chris? <laughs> so after the wind ring system, Ignacio, um, you need to learn the difference between what uh, the different balls do. Know your balls, it is crucial. And I can already f see the chat flooding with ball jokes when I say know your balls. It's coming. I know it's coming. <laughs> You'd need to understand what the different spin do, what the different stats do. What does wind resistance mean? What does side spin mean? mean and what does top spin mean? Uh, not top spin, a power mean. Those three stats that affect your ball, you will have to know. Uh, <laughs> here we go. Drew is starting right there. <laughs> uh, that is crucial. Uh, there's a section on ball stats in my guides guide. You can download it on my website. It's called the guides guide. How to adapt to a different level clubs and balls using uh, the website golfclashnotebook.io. 
know the stat differences, know how uh, the stat differences affect uh, the shot. It's very theoretical, but it's worth it. You need to understand what does what, how a shot reacts the way it does to what you do. <laughs> True! Oh my goodness! I knew it was coming! I knew it was coming! <laughs> I love it, guys! Uh, pretty um, disappointing back nine here, guys. Very disappointing. Couldn't get it done. 15 on the front, and the back just didn't pan out. And that happens sometimes. And we had a 30 under opening that would have been good for the win. So we messed up towards the end, um, a little bit unlucky. I mean, if we drop uh, six and seven here on the back nine, we should have dropped 10. We didn't drop uh, two uh, once. We couldn't go for Albatross with our clubs. It's tough, um, but I'm still happy. It looks like we're gonna get a top five in our first full uh, tournament with Aka Heron, the account created last week, and that is not too shabby at all. So I'm gonna be happy with this, even if I could not repeat my opening round, you know. Exactly, elevation, key. Know what elevation does and what it means, but you can only know about elevation once you know the wind ring system, because if you don't adjust for wind, uh, for rings, it doesn't matter if you adjust plus 10 or not, because if you're just going by the naked eye, you can never adjust plus 10% or 20. All right. I'm going to take another short break, and I'll be back shortly with uh, Jamima Gina, the other baby, albeit a little higher up. She's uh, in her fourth tournament, I think. So, uh, yeah. Thank you, Ty. Uh, absolutely, random guy. Absolutely. Um, we need the lows to enjoy the highs. If we just have highs, it's it's boring. If I'm going to score 40 under every tournament and win gold all the time, I couldn't be, you know, I could as well quit the game. There's no challenge in that anymore. It's no fun. It's no fun. So, okay, I'm going to be back in about five minutes. I uh, hope you can stay. If not, you have a great day, evening, morning, wherever you are. Otherwise, I'm going to see you very, very soon. Stay tuned.
All right, guys, I am back. Let's get this done with Jamima Gina. That was our best rookie score. I was very surprised that we shot our best score with our baby. But that happens sometimes when we don't expect anything. It's going to be different now because now we expect something, if you know what I mean. <laughs> we had no expectations until we shot the 32 under, uh, which was crazy. Crazy score for Jimmy Magina and her uh, good clubs, but uh, lacking in some respects. So um, see what we can do with uh, Jamima. Uh, you got the video on elevation up. That is good as well. Awesome, guys. Great work there. Oh, I have an upgrade available for the machete. Don't know. The, don't need that. And the horizon, almost, almost uh, another level. Still have level one here. Why do I have two big dogs here? I don't need them. Gonna use my fantastic sniper five. That is what we're gonna use here for Jimima's uh, bag number one. Let me just set that up right now. Less wind resistant during the lockdown. Drew! <laughs> what is your problem with uh, buying balls, Ignacio? Low winds for the win. Pressure is on. Ab absolutely, McDilson. Pressure is on now. So. Question is question is are we gonna buy I don't think we bought the package with Jimmy Magina should we buy the uh, the pack here the small one the small one just in case we get high wins on seven uh, that would be for the win no worries, Drew, no worries. Uh, you're doing a good job entertaining the crowd. So should we buy the small package here? So we have the season 21 ball in case we have high wind on seven. I think that could be a difference between uh, going for gold or not. Hey Mick, good luck in your rounds. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I really appreciate it. Nice, Mr. Magoo. Unlucky, though. You're only second with uh, 30 under. So, I know what you're going to say. You're going to say, buy them. Yeah, exactly. I used it on 7-2 with other accounts, and it was in, in the higher wins. I'm going to buy them. Exactly. I knew you were going to say that. I knew guys were saying that. Here we go. It's coming up. Yeah, Todd is here. Well, yeah, no, not really, Todd. Not really. Not at the moment, no. Tough times. <laughs> hey, look at that. Malibu upgrade. That's going to come in handy, maybe. Oh, the Firefly. I really wanted another Horizon, but we're going to upgrade the Malibu. For sure. That's going to make a difference. Maybe. I hope we don't need it. I hope we do not need it. The rest of the bag is fine. So we have them, just in case. Just in case. Yes, uh, Drew, absolutely. Small one. 
I just need two of the balls if I do uh, at all. I'm gonna only use them if I have such high wind that I have to adjust into un uh, under power to get rid of that. Come on, let's do this. Exactly, Quasars, a few Titans, always good, always good, max plus 10, and these are the new graphics, people have been asking about them a lot, so also extra my 4, it's gonna be just fine, we don't need more in Rookie, At least we start with a perfect. Let's look at the yardage. Uh, 320... 321? 322. Let's uh, finish with a stellar round. I have one more in me. I feel it. One more. Already a tad late, but I feel I have one more uh, good round in me. Was pretty disappointing the back nine there with uh, Acker. Wow, that's way too much. But he's short, maybe it's not too much. No, it wasn't. It was perfect. It was perfect. Well played. Wow. Nicely done there. Congrats. Two and a half back. One point nine rings. And that should be in the hole. And it is dead center. Boom. That's how we want to start. Uh, Naeem, tomorrow, five accounts. Five pros tomorrow. Thank you for the booms. Thank you, McDilson. Thank you, Stefan. And that's how we want to start a round here. Thank you, Wayne. Thank you, Mr. Magoo. Thank you, Zilke. Thank you, Todd and Aragon Killer. Appreciate it very much. Thank you, Mauro. Obrigado, Mauro. Appreciate it. Gotta learn Portuguese for you. My Portuguese, uh, I don't speak Portuguese, but I'm gonna learn some for you, Mauro. <laughs> Thank you, Naeem. Good start, I like it. I like that start. Oh, number two coming up. Let's hope for low wind. <laughs> Lots of new people to the channel, Todd. It's been blowing up. And you've been working a lot, so... You've been missing what's been happening the past 10 days. It's been absolutely crazy, Todd. That's right, Mr. Magoo giving some booms for Mr. McDilson's giveaway yesterday. He does that sometimes. Just out of the kindness of his heart giving away small ball packages on stream. Oh, use the Daruma on hole two. Interesting, Drew. In rookie? You win ball wanker there. <laughs> 3.8 back. 
Here we go. Line it up on the fringe. Line it up at the hole. Straight at the hole. As good as we as well as we can here with the uh, with the seven, the little point there going through the hole. Now we add 0.9 left spin. Adjust max plus 25, 2.6 rings. Hit perfect. Hit the fringe. Oh, so close. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Good try. A very good try, but yeah. Maybe I didn't line it up exactly. Center hole, kind of hard to see. Uh, with the backbone 7, backbone 8, I think, is the difference maker, if I'm not mistaken. Let me just have a look here at the ball guide. Yeah, backbone 8. Backbone 8 is the difference maker with the uh, ball guide line. Tommy Land. <laughs> Uh, Todd, not the very first. I've got the, the list in order of people who came in the chat. So I don't know if you were the first one in the stream. I just know the first ones who, uh, who did, uh, write in the chat. Where's that list? Where's my list? I did have a list here. It's gone. It's gone. My list is gone. Where is it? Nope, not here. So yeah, I have the list of the 12 people who were in the very first chat. In the very first stream. And who wrote something in chat. So, um... Oh, I love his name, by the way. Schwing. Swing, and all of the cl the clan Jedi warriors. Punisher, thanks for the good luck. Uh, no, this account is not that old, Scott. Not at all. It's a pretty new one. It's her. Um... Where are we at here? 431 games played, fourth tournament. Third real tournament. So, yeah, not that old. Third real tournament. So, she's about uh, a month old, a little over a month old, I believe. Five weeks. Five week old account. Oh no, this is the wrong one. Need to switch my bag. What am I doing? Come on, get it together now. It's the quarterback and the sniper five. Just cutting it kind of close with the uh, backspin but it's gonna be okay I'll switch my bag here I don't have that many bags so I need to switch uh, the horizon out for the sniper 5 and then we're gonna play this hole with a quasar quarterback sniper quasar Hey, KB, welcome back, Kevin. How you doing? Yeah, I need to find it, Todd. I had the list. I, I, I watched the first uh, stream there. It was painful at times, I have to say, looking back at it. It's only been three and a half months ago, but it's like, oh my goodness, that's like, it looks like the dark ages of my stream. Kind of, it hasn't evolved pretty, you know, I didn't even see the evolution, uh, just didn't even realize it, uh, just looking back now. Okay, we have high wind here. High wind. I'm going to take a top spin off. I'm going to go with two. Anything above four, four and a half is uh, going to be uh, too far down. And I need some more room to adjust because um, I have less backspin. So 4.8 is, is not cool. 
I'd prefer a lower wind. Thank you, Wayne. Yeah. It's time for beast mode. It's a shame about two, but uh, yeah. So what we are at, 307 would be cool. 303 is perfect as well. Where is that list? That was only, uh, it wasn't that long ago. I don't know where that is. I did not throw it away for sure. It was doing this uh, stream here this week. Uh, I think it was on Wednesday I used the list and I certainly did not throw it away. It's probably under the keyboard, right? It is under the keyboard. If you don't find something on your desk, it's under the keyboard. <laughs> Isn't that right? If you don't find a note, it's under the keyboard. So, should I read you guys the list of the 12 people in my very first stream? I have it in front of me. The names, in order uh, how they wrote in chat. That's the only uh, refer reference point I have. <laughs> hey, Corey Conley. Sorry, I didn't see you come in. Corey, how you doing? Sorry, Corey. Another high wind here. So it's good we're actually on the shorter side. So we're gonna use all of the backspin, which is not quite three, the three we want, but it'll have to do. We don't have the ball guideline, we want to drop it. Let me blow up my screenshot so I can see that uh, better. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Here on that dark square, just on the edge of the fringe, and then uh, 3.6 rings. So I just focus on the landing position, because I do not have a ball guideline. Let's see uh, if we can hit the funnel. Dead center! Boom, baby! Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Boom, baby! Yes, sir! That's exactly what I'm talking about. Boom! Hell yeah! Oh my goodness! Who needs a ball guideline when you have a guide with uh, screenshots? <laughs> oh my goodness! Thank you, KB. Thank you, Scott. Thank you, Meg Dilson. Thank you, Zilke. Thank you, Dan. Thank you, Paul. Thank you, Jay. Thank you, Punisher, for the toast bombs. Thank you, Mr. Magoo. Thank you, Naeem. Thank you, Aragon Killer. Thank you, Nick K. Thank you, Peter. Thank you, Drew. <laughs> Thank you, Scott. A headbanger's boom emoji. Yeah, exactly, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you showed up on time, KB. Thank you, Stefan. Yeah, and the choo choo. Thank you, Nick K. Thank you, Agap. You need a ball guideline? Nobody needs a ball guideline, Drew. We just line it up, landing position, focus on the landing position, and that's it. Because we use the ball guideline of the Sniper 7 from the uh, screenshot. So if you don't have it, look at the ball uh, at the screenshot. Focus on the bounce, and that's in. Thank you, Chris. Maybe we uh, do have a, a, a good final round in us. Maybe we do. Now I will feel really good about dropping a uh, hole four for the first time today. We've been missing that.
All right. <sighs> so I need to, I need to settle down. <laughs> Tom Taplin, welcome Tom. How you doing? Thank you for the good luck. We had a good start. Barely missed the ace on two, but we dropped one and a three. Very good shot there as well. Nice shot. Bouncing over. Oh, the music was on point. Absolutely there. Absolutely, Scott. I agree. <laughs> two and a half right. Five and a half top. Only 1.4 rings, max plus 15. Thing is, we need to drop it. This is the kick we want right there. And now we need to uh, aim it about a square to the right, like this. Kind of like this, right here. 1.4. We hit perfect. Did we judge the square right? Come on, roll. Not quite, not quite, but uh, still a good try, blind. Still a good try. A bit too much to the right here, I believe. Tough one. Not as easy as uh, to set up without the ball guideline, but uh, okay. No shame in this. Oh no, Smegdilson. I feel you, just like we just did with uh, Acker. I'm gonna forfeit this as usual. Okay, before I start, uh, because we had a problem with the Horizon uh, 1, I'm happy, I gl I'm glad I got the Horizon 1 finally. Because we played it with the big dog. So, the difference, Horizon 1 to Horizon 3. So I'm gonna go to the golf -dash notebookio before taking the shot. So Horizon 3 has uh, three more yards. Then my one. The accuracy is zero on the one, that is bad. Uh, top spin is the same. The ball guideline is worse as well on the one, that's not good. I, I'm probably go not gonna have that third bounce. Or maybe just, I don't know if I have enough uh, of the ball guideline here. So, um, we'll see. I need to change to the horizon. So, not sure. It's a trickier horizon shot than with the horizon 3, but I'll still give it a go. It's the best chance I have on 5. Why is it yellow? Mo, that is a new graphics. New graphics uh, that were introduced at the start of the year. So any account that has been created this year uh, could get these graphics. I created four counts this year, and this is the only one that got the graphics, so um, I can't tell you why we got it or why the others didn't. It's just a, a matter of luck or, or bad luck, if you will, because I absolutely detest these graphics. I hate them, but I'll have to make do. Stefan, why? Why, thanks. Ah, oh, you got the whole one, the whole four in pro. Wow, awesome! Congrats, Stefan. I'm I'm happy for you. Awesome. Congrats to, for the hole in one on four in pro. Awesome. So glad uh, to hear that, Stefan. You go on, guys. You crush it. Come on. <laughs> Love it. 
I just love it when you do well. Two top, max left, max plus. Ten, <clears throat> sorry, max plus ten. Four point one. curl this much as shown in the guide we hit perfect and that should be perfect distance around 295 maybe a little short 293 290 295 it is awesome that's it show some love to Stefan for his holding one on four that's awesome really awesome Stefan because it's a tough one in any division. Hole four is tough. This is the perfect example why you should not go long. Trees, trees, trees are no good here. Unless you uh, make a hole in one off the tree, like the shot of the week. Pretty sure that guy loves the tree there towards the end you gotta play the shot Gavin running out of time running out of time you need to add curl curl to the right nice okay now the tough stuff here I have less distance so I'm gonna uh, actually add a little top spin probably to the four I need to find the right lining position and uh, it's gonna be tricky. It's, it's easier with the uh, Horizon 3 for sure. It's easier with the Horizon 3. So I'm not sure how close we're gonna get. We're lacking a little bit of distance. So actually that's why I'm happy I'm at 295. Do I have that third bounce? Um, barely. So I need to pull it back. To right here. A little further down, just at the edge of the the. That's pretty much as uh, as as well as I can judge this one. A bit to the left, uh, 3.3 is 1.1 ring. Okay, this is for the moment the best I can judge this shot with the horizon level one. And we'll just see where we end up. Uh, we have a lack of ball guideline. Do we get the right bounce here uh, without it dying down? I think we did. Uh, speed is perfect. That was... It's not in, but... I'm really happy with the shot, though. Really happy with that shot. Wow. CJ8, welcome. How you doing, Ken? Oh, no way. You did. I'm sorry to hear that. That was an excellent shot, guys. An excellent shot with the uh, Horizon 1. We, we, we don't drop it, but uh, it's okay. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, Naeem, right? It happens. But it's a good shot with, with the Horizon 1. No regrets. I, I know we need to get a little lucky to, to get in the hole. It's uh, the best I could do with uh, what I had. Just the little, the little extra luck uh, was needed there. And maybe we'll get lucky on the back. Who knows? Who knows? No one knows. We'll see in about nine holes. We can't be thinking about that now. 30 under with four missed shots. Uh, that's still very good, uh, CJ. So it's not that bad. I know the missed shots hurt. We had so many misses. So many misses today. But it's it's kind of like this in this tourney. So every time you miss a, a, a sure shot, uh, it's 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 hurting. It hurts a lot. Naeem, thank you for stopping by. It was a pleasure as always, my friend. Thank you for the good luck and yes, hope to see you tomorrow, Naeem. 
Ah, oh, see, you improved. Five shots. That's nice, uh, Ken. Very nice. Yeah, just see where you end up. I mean, uh, no shame in a 30 under by any means. So we ended up short last time. I don't know why. It was really weird. I hit a perfect shot. Still, end of the bunker right there. We have a little more wind this time. Maybe it was the low wind last time. Maybe. Still, I, I feel like perfect should have at least cleared the bunker. It did not. I'm going to use less curl here. In this wind. And hopefully... Um, Get it over the bunker and get a good line here. Drop down, roll down, come on, roll, 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 roll. A little more curl this time. A little more curl, but a good try again. We have good misses here. <laughs> it's time to Feeling the love. Yeah, come on, 30 under is a very good score. When you said you fudged it up, I really thought, oh no, here comes the 23 under or something. <laughs> But yeah, I, I feel you though, I feel you. Every miss hurts here. Sitting fifth. Sitting fifth, that is very unlucky CJ, very unlucky. That is crazy. That's a tough bracket. Yeah, but that's the thing in expert. Expert brackets are tough. Lots of very good players out there. And that is... Roll off, roll off. Please. Get on the fringe. Get on the fringe. Don't stay. Don't... No, no. Don't stay on the green. Don't do it. Come on. Fringe, fringe, fringe. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, my goodness. That is very unlucky. That's the worst spot you can be in. I'd rather be uh, on the fringe there. Oh, my goodness. Poor guy. So, uh, Eagle, easy one. Take it. That is uh, very tough luck there. Uh, I, I'm not sure, uh, CJ. We'll see in a moment. At least he's got a Kingmaker, but still, I feel this is... Uh, no, he cannot reach. He can... Can he reach? Come on, go. No. What do you have to do in this case? Uh, go left. And you need to hit, uh, don't hit it perfect, hit it uh, to the left. You need to hit it uh, way left, like kind of a hook. You know what I mean? If you don't have the distance like that, go max. Because the ball guideline shows you missing to the right, uh, you cannot get there. So, uh, go for a hook shot. Uh, if there is such a, a thing in in, 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 uh, in in putting, you know what I mean? Just arrow all the way to the left on purpose to get that extra uh, roll there. Uh, it will be lucky, but it's at least you're gonna get a, have a shot, you know. That's the only thing uh, I can suggest you uh, there. I c That's a tough one. Okay, sniper five, not ideal. I'd like a sniper six but I don't have one and we're gonna use a marlin for starters if not uh, if we have high wind season 21 ball it will be min plus 10 oh nice Ken 16 on the front awesome yeah uh, very unlucky for the opponent but I would have uh, played it with uh, full left, not even close to perfect, just full left. And I hope it drops. I uh, hope it gets the extra uh, kick to the left that will uh, roll over the bump. Because hitting it perfect like this, you're just going to give up. It's not going to go in anyway. So uh, take a chance. Take a chance with the shot to the left. Alba 9 is always nice. That is awesome. Didn't have one yet, but we're going to go for the dunk tomorrow. 
Exactly. Or at least the fringe. I was I was calling the ball to, to roll down the fringe. 2.9. What a nice, lovely wind. Two point four rings. Here we go. This is the kick walk forward we want. The kick forward we want. Line it up at the hole right here. Two point four. We don't need to push up here. And hope for the good kick. Oh, I shanked this one. Stay. And that was a very poor shot. Perfect is in. Perfect is in. I deserve a slap for this poor shot. Horrible. Toast! You are the worst! <laughs> now focus and get your act together, no. Toasty! Oh, this pains me. Not the time to hit a poor shot like that when we get a gift with the wind like that. Come on, are you kidding me? That was a, a gift, I tell you, a gift. Yeah, I don't have to save it, Mo. It was a very nice shot, except for the great. A very bad great at that. What a shame. So we got the drop on one, we got the drop on three, and we got the drop on six. I would like another drop here, guys. This would have uh, gotten me on track for 16 on the front. So um, I have to drop eight. I haven't dropped eight all day. Uh, for a variety of reasons. I might actually consider spending a, a, a wind ball on a eight just to get the drop. Why? Because I'm a weekend round WBR. Uh, WBW, sorry. Here we go. I'm gonna have a look uh, at what I have here. What are my options? Because I'm not gonna play with the Grim Reaper. I'm gonna spend uh, at least a power two ball so I can play the backbone. Because the backbone seven is lacking. A distance uh, compared to the Backbone 9 or the Grim Reaper. What's this? Uh, nope. Oh, that's nice. I'm gonna use that. Power 2 ball and win 4. That's what I'm gonna use. Ha ha ha. You were thinking playing to a seven. All right, come on. Good luck, Dio Midi Dai. So uh, let's see this. Only you realized it in the shootout. <laughs> no way, Mo. No way. Okay, so I'm gonna play let's play the enforcer ball here, see if it makes a difference. Uh, for the second shot mainly. So power two, so we have the distance with the uh, backbone seven. And um, the wind resistance, so we don't have to adjust into the bunker for the rough bump. And those are the two reasons why I use this ball. And if it gets me the drop, fine. I'm gonna play it again next time. If not, I'm gonna go with the katana on the back nine. But I really feel I need an extra drop here, guys. 
I need an extra drop on the front. I want to have a 16 on the front. I want a 16 on the front. We're just missing the one here. And we just... We would have been fine had I not missed that stupid ace there on 7. So let's see. We need to get all the way down there, but not roll in the rough. And that is nice. Very nice. I like this. 309. I think that's uh, exactly what we need for the rough bump. Um, we can't be any shorter than that. We're kind of living on the edge here. We need the max from the power 2 ball to, to be in uh, rough bump range. And that was the plan anyway. That was the plan. So yeah, 4.1 wind he has. Uh, I'm actually now I'm glad I've got the power, uh, the wind 4 ball. So I want to have wind where I don't drop it in the sand with this, uh, with the adjustment. Brandon, welcome. Thanks for the good luck. Uh, we played the rough bump here all the time. I love me some good rough bumps. It's more fun when we drop a rough bump, CJ. <laughs> it's a lovely one. It looks cool. We'll see. We'll see. Not with a great, ah, oh, come on. It did, it did, it did, but not today. It worked in the opening round, it worked in qualifying, but not today. I don't know why. I mean, I know why. I hit so many greats today, Ken. So many greats, uh, it was painful. And always on this hole. It's not a big deal. I'm not gonna worry about it too much. We're gonna drop it on back nine. Gonna use a power three ball next time. Uh, two is cutting it very close with extra uh, with backbone seven. We are lacking too much distance. Just lacking too much distance. Maybe we get a lucky Albi on uh, on uh, nine. If not, fifteen under is uh, is not a shame. Yeah, but the distance is the same. Mo wind is afterwards. So whatever uh, wind resistance the ball has, the max distance of power two is the same. So even if I had a, a wind resistance zero power two ball, the max distance is the same. Uh, the wind will add the distance afterwards, not uh, uh, change where you can aim. Yeah, I, I heard that too, CJ. Caden, welcome. Uh, others say restart the app. <laughs> Ada Smith, welcome. How you doing? We're doing fine. We've had a, we've been had a, a fun day, a very fun day. This is account number six of the day, the last one for today. We shot a very bad 26 under with Jane. We shot an excellent 31 under with Blair. So we had a bit of everything. I'm not too unhappy. How did your rounds go, Caden and uh, Ada Smith? Let me know. How did you do? Did you play today? Yeah, Nick K, right? Don't risk it going for the Fluke Albi. 
it's so hard not to. Okay, I'm gonna play it safe, Nick. I'm gonna play this one safe. Go for the uh, eagle. We're gonna do that. We're gonna go for safe eagle here. I promise you. I promise you that. Last time I also said we're gonna go for safe eagle and then we went for the LB and mess messed it up. But I didn't promise it back then. I just said... Just tell me I'm a stupid idiot for going for the LB. So, um... Especially with these lower level clubs, you know. So this time I promise you I will go for safe eagle. No matter where I end up. So no risk here. Full call to the left. And that gives me gives, 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 gets me in perfect position to, to play with the big dog at the top of that uh, fairway shelf. Thank you, Wayne. Oh, you don't believe me? I'll show you. Oh. I'm glad to hear that, Ada Smith. Um, depends on when you uh, watch the guide. I mean, there's no new guide coming out today. So the, uh, the version that was online uh, yesterday is the version that uh, I'm playing with. And if you're playing pro, uh, I've uploaded the new version of the pro guide this morning. So rookie is the version from uh, Thursday night and pro is the version from this morning. So I'm going to go for safe eagle just because. Just because uh, I can go for the Albi. I can go for the Albi. I can go for the Albi. Wait for it. On 18, if I have to. So now I just want to play safe. Not go for the albatross at all. I just want to get it to green or the fringe. It doesn't really matter. Uh, and that is not actually uh, that bad. I have a putt. I'm going to make the eagle. Uh, KB, yes, uh, pro guides. Uh, co uh, pro guides uh, are out today. So the pro guides are the version of this morning. And uh, rookie is still the version from after the opening round on uh, Thursday. Yeah, yeah, welcome Richard. It is bedtime. It is uh, half an hour to midnight. Yeah, pro is tomorrow. Tomorrow I'll play five pros. So we make an eagle here, signed for 15 under, attack the back nine in good spirits and not uh, angry about us being too aggressive and messing up, uh, unless I miss this putt here, so I, don't, I really hope that uh, I don't do that because we've missed it in pro. Uh, a very stupid miss, but uh, a, a miss nevertheless. We didn't give it our full attention. We didn't give it any attention, by the way. We, we just putted, uh, talked to the camera, talked to you guys, you know, and just putted and uh, boom. We missed. So focus on those uh, the, uh, the easy shots, guys. That's all I can tell you. Focus on the easy shots, no matter how uh, easy they look. Give it your full attention, <laughs> because if you don't, it's going to bite you in the ass. <laughs> Jordan, welcome, Jordan. How you doing? First five holes, four eagles and an albi. I would take that, Richard. I would take that for sure. Thank you, CJ. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Oh, CJ is streaming as well. So uh, anyone who's streaming, feel free to drop your links in here. Thank you, Wayne. Thank you so much for hanging out. I uh, really appreciate it. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Good luck in your rounds, Wayne. Good luck. Crush it. 
Oh wow, I got another donation. Did that pop up, uh, pop up in stream? About eight minutes ago? I don't know if he's in, in the chat here. Nick Angelillo. Nick Angelillo, are you here in the stream? Who's Nick Angelillo? Because we're getting some donors as well for the guides from the website and they're not necessarily in the stream, but if you are here, I want to thank you properly for the uh, for your five dollar donation, Nick Angelillo. I hope I can thank you properly because otherwise there's no way of uh, thanking you. All right, open the pin chest real quick, and then we're gonna go on our five minute break. Marlins on the par threes. Nice, Richard. Wow, an expert. That is crazy. Uh, yes, I do, Nick. I take donations uh, through PayPal at the moment. So, yeah. So I just got that. But uh, they don't pop up on, on stream all the time. I don't know. I think there's two links. One is PayPal and the other is PayPal via, via Streamlabs. And I think you need to donate via Streamlabs to have it pop up in the uh, in the window uh, otherwise it won't show but yeah don't don't any, uh, feel any pressure to donate guys it's not about the money it's about the fun we are having here which does not mean I don't appreciate donations from time to time of course okay hole number uh, 10 coming up just want to set up my bag before going on break here we go I'll be back in five, guys. I hope you can stay. No, you won the prize. No way, Nick. You win the prize. Come on, keep it, please, please. Use some wind balls. Oh, I look fancy? Oh, maybe because I don't have a hoodie for once. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you can stay tuned. I'll be back in five.
And we're back. No slap yet. No slap yet. I don't want to see a slap on the back nine, guys. <laughs> All right. Uh... Robito is back. Welcome. Uh, Punisher, why can't you watch Toast on the TV? That is weird. Depends on the TV. I can watch anything on uh, on my TV. Are you casting it from your uh, mobile or are you watching by a smart TV Punisher? Because you should, uh, you can watch Toast on TV, so it's got not, it's not a problem with the channel. I don't know if I can help. Just let me know how you play it, how you watch it. Jimima, where are ya? I'm not gonna look at the scores, alright? Not looking at the scores. It's too early for that. That's weird, Punisher. I mean, I'm uh, when I'm watching YouTube on my on my, my uh, TV, which is a Samsung TV, I have the YouTube app, and there everything works. I haven't casted it, so I don't know about that, but uh, with the YouTube app in the Smart TV, it usually works. Mr. Magoo! Did I see you? Did I miss you come in, Mr. Magoo? If so, hello. Welcome back. Always a pleasure. It's restricted. Do you maybe have parental control on Punisher? Because my channel is set as uh, not made for kids. I had to do that on YouTube. So if you have some kind of parental control, that might restrict it. That's the only thing I can... You're not... Yeah, you are the parent, but uh, I, I had the problem sometimes that I still had parental control on and uh, it was switched to my kid's profile. So... That's what I mean. Then I couldn't access stuff and I had to switch to my profile. Alright, let's uh, watch uh, the yardage here closely. Three twenty one, three three twenty three. Okay. Uh, this should be dropped if I don't choke now. No, don't think about choking. Don't think about choking. <laughs> don't think about choking. That's a very important tip I'm going to give you. Do not think about choking. Keep it positive. Do not say, don't hit great. You have to say, hit perfect. You have to uh, respond in the affirmative. Otherwise, it's not gonna work out. Okay, let's, let's focus on this, hit perfect. 1.6 rings. Alright, we hit perfect. Now get in the hole. Straight in the middle. Start we needed. Whew. That's a big one. A big one right there. Good start. All right. Uh. <laughs> Thank you, McDilson. 
Thank you, Mr. Magoo. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you, Punisher. Thank you, Zilke and Jay and Bob. Thank you so much, everyone. Much appreciated. Oh, wow. Well, that's the start we want right there. Thank you, Peter. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. All good. All good. Switch to Navi here for hole number two. Thank you, Mo. That's how we want to start. Hope for lower wins here. Because also this par 3 is trickier in higher winds. Uh, it's gonna be... How lucky are we gonna get? Low wind. Oh no, he's a kingmaker. He's got a kingmaker here. Should still be okay though. Rockwood is here. Welcome, Mr. Rockwood. How you doing, Rock? Another streamer. As I said before, if you're streaming, drop your links, guys. You can drop your links. Feel free. Thanks for the good luck, Rock. This is the last round of the day. My baby, Jamima Gina. Jamima Gina. Come on, let's start with a hole-in-one here. 3.5, that's good, I like it. 3.8 back. Land on the fringe. Aim it at the center of the hole as best as we can with this ball guide. As best as we can. And now we add 0.9 left spin. Still keeping the 3.8 back. 0.9 left spin, 2.7 rings. Come on, go in the hole with the fringe. Oh, wow, my goodness. Oh, come on. Oh, that's good, Rock. That is good. Wow, you drove to the close to the green on hole three. We're not playing that way. We're playing the funnel with the sniper. That's all I need, GCA. No worries, Rock. No worries at all. You you focus on getting better, Rock. Oh, that was a shame. I did not line it up properly. I said to you earlier, the Backbone 8 is uh, the game changer with the ball guideline. We should probably just aimed it a little bit too right of the hole here. It's kind of a thing here. Oh, awesome. Congrats, Jay. Congrats. Well done. Oh, don't worry. No, Nick. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, Nick. Come on. You won that fair and square for McDilson. Otherwise, McDilson's not going to give away uh, the money anymore if you just keep on donating it back to me, you know. <laughs> Otherwise, we don't need to have a giveaway on the stream. Come on, enjoy it. Treat yourself to this amazing ball pack here. Uh, oh yeah, good. We need to change our quarterback uh, bag here to the sniper. It is essential, even if it's a sniper five. That's how we dropped it earlier, focusing on the landing position and not uh, the ball guideline. Uh, that's gonna be crucial. Oh, McDilson says it's okay. Oh my god, the love here in the chat, I like it. <laughs> All right, let's do this. So I don't know if by any chance... If by any chance... Where is it? Where is it? If by any chance Nick Angelillo is in the chat, it would be nice if you could let me know because I want to thank you properly for your donation. As is, 
as if uh, and also Stan Blueberry if Stan Blueberry is here I would also like to thank you properly so shout out in the chat if you're here otherwise it's gonna be hard to thank you with the gopher the only friendly gopher we have 29 that's awesome rock yeah, uh, I I, can't, I I won't give out wrenches at the moment. Uh, Jordan already uh, said that a few times. Oh, uh, a lot of wind, less uh, less top spin here, because we just have too many people in here. Uh, Jordan, it's gonna uh, it's blowing up uh, incredibly, and I need to to think about how we um, gonna move forward with modding from here. And that's why at the moment it's uh, there will be no more wrenches added and that is not meant as an offense to anyone oh great left oh please don't clip the rough don't clip the rough it's gonna clip the rough I might still be fine uh, we're losing yardage a lot of yardage, a lot of yardage. Uh, that's not good. We have to improvise now. No worries, John. I know you weren't there. That's why I just want to say it. Um, no offense to anyone. Uh, we'll see how we go forward with uh, modding. But anyway, you know, the modding was fun in the beginning. Modding everyone, but... I don't want to complain, but... The channel blowing up over the past week says uh, it's gonna be new challenges if you know what I mean challenges I'm not saying I don't like it I love it uh, we've had so much traffic these past days and the past 10 days really were crazy and I enjoyed every moment of it I appreciate each and every one coming by dropping by it's just a lot of fun Uh, Robito, uh, we shot some very good rounds and we shot a very bad round. I mean very bad. We shot a 26. I was really unhappy with it. Really unhappy with the 26. It's all my doing. Just greats. Great lefts. Great lefts. Great rights. Okay, the problem here. We have two problems. We are not in min distance, which is here. And this is max distance. We're closer to max distance. For which we need a lot more backspin, but we don't have it. We don't have the backspin. The other problem is, I need to land it here. That is where I need to land it to catch the funnel. But I would need more than the three backspin to get it to stop. So I don't know if I can get this to drop. At least we hit perfect, we'll see in a moment. But uh, yeah, that's my problem here. Can we get enough uh, slowdown? No, we cannot. It's too, uh, too speedy. There's nothing really I could have done here with a sniper there. So uh, it really killed me that I clipped the rough, uh, which is a shame. Nick K, Nick K. Thank you so much for the donation, Nick K. Really appreciate it. Thank you so much, Nick. Yeah, it's a fast green. So, yeah. Awesome, Nick. And Russell, you're also, oh my goodness, two donations coming in at the same time. So amazing. Thank you so much, Nick K. Uh, this is for you, Nick K. Money. Money, money, money. Money. Thanks for your donation. You rock. Show Nick K some love. Nick K, you rock. Thank you so much. 
and right after Russell Rossman. That is uh, amazing. Thank you so much, Rossman, for your twenty dollar donation. I appreciate that enormously. Uh, thank you so much, Rossman. Uh, this is for you, Rossman. Show Rossman some love in here. Thank you so much, Mr. Rossman. Money, 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 money. money. That's for your donation. You. Rock. That's right. You rock, Mr. Rossman. Rossman and Nick Hay, thank you so much. I thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Really, really appreciate it, guys. That's amazing. So let me drop the hole in one for you guys. Gotta try to. That's it. That's how we show some love here with all the booms and the toasts, some steaks thrown in, some bombs. <laughs> I don't know if uh, I, that depends on YouTube, Jordan. I have no idea. I applied for, for their monetization program. I don't know. It's gonna take a while. So we'll get super chat as well. Just so you know, uh, much appreciated, Rossman. I thank you. I thank you. Thank you so much. What's too late, Nick K? What did I miss? Too late. Too late. Too late. Oh, exactly. Yeah, that's what you meant, Nick. Hey, yeah. So thank you so much, Nick. <laughs> it is true. No, KB, I don't have Super Chat. They only donated via uh, uh, PayPal. I have the links in there, but never, ever feel obliged to donate, please. But I appreciate it a lot. I really, really do. Okay, let's aim at the hole. Right here. And aim it about a square to the right. Like here. Uh, 1.2 rings. Here we go. Perfect. Let's see where we end up. Do we get the right bounce here? No, it's coming in too hot. Too hot. And too right. Oh, no way, McDilson. Daniel and Ian in the drill stream. Uh, which hole are they playing, McDilson? Which hole are they playing? Have they just started or uh, are they uh, nearing the end? And honestly, people, if you want to watch Daniel and Ian in a dual stream, battling it out, uh, no hard feelings if you want to switch over there. No hard feelings. I would do it myself. I would switch to that channel in a heartbeat. Just started. Okay, good. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be able to catch the end of it at least. So we have uh, five more hosts to go. So I can at least catch uh, some of it. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you uh, dropping the info. Oh, that's awesome. I, I would love to see that. Would love to see that. <laughs> Milan, welcome. Yeah, we're not uh, replacing the battery. We're not gonna do that. Oh, thank you, KB. Uh, wrong bag, quarterback and uh, horizon. We have a saying here, Milan, a saying in this channel. It's the channel where time stands still. So no, I'm not gonna change the battery. <laughs> It's kind of an inside joke now, a running gag here. <laughs> Jeffrey Harris, welcome. 
Thank you for the good luck. We're finishing up today. <laughs> also do a streaming. <laughs> that is crazy. Watching too many streams there? A few too many streams? So it's a shame about the Albi miss on, on three, but uh, we missed uh, messed up the drive. It's hard enough as it is from min distance with the sniper five, but from that distance with the lack of backspin, it's it's super tough. So it's it's it is what it is. But we got the drop on one, so it's okay. I still need a few more though. I have no idea where the leader's at. 15 on the front. So uh, an Albi here would be uh, very welcome. Oh, uh, that's very nice. Uh, that should net you a few uh, Kingmakers for sure, Jordan. Absolutely. That's a very good score. 33 in Rookie Jeffy. Awesome. Congrats. Three Albers. Three Albers. So. Let me guess, you've got, uh, oh, oh, we're not playing Quasars, we're playing Titans. So you got uh, three twice and five once. Is that it? Jeffrey, is that it? Three twice and five once? Yeah, nice. Very nice, Jeffy. Well done. That is awesome. I mean, people have been getting uh, Albus on 9 as well, but it's so rare. 293, perfect distance here. Perfect for my horizon. Yes, they have, McDilson. They have. It's been like that for a few days, maybe a week. You cannot click on people's uh, dots anymore to go to that channel. I don't know why they changed it. I have no uh, no idea why. Yeah, John's got now on nine, but that was pro Jordan. Or did he also drop it in rookie? I don't want to say. Uh, uh, I don't want to say Jordan that. An LB on, on 9 in Pro is uh, worth less. But yes, no, I'm saying that, sorry. <laughs> Wind is good. No, but uh, that was excellent, Jordan. Absolutely brilliant. So third bounce should be uh, just on the fringe there. Just before the fringe is where I want it to land. Just before the fringe, like here. Okay, let's adjust here and hopefully uh, nail this one. It's a tricky one uh, with the Horizon 1. Yeah, no, it was awesome. I told you that, Jordan. It was a freaking awesome uh, dunk uh, drop there on, uh, on 9. Absolutely, I've got to give you that. Oh, again, again, same spot. Speed, perfect, everything perfect. But we do need uh, a little luck uh, with uh, the Horizon 1. It's, 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 it's how it is on 5 in Rookie with low-level clubs. Closer earlier, yeah. Unlucky McDilson. But we need some luck there. What? Check PayPal again, Punisher. Are you crazy? What did I miss now? Punisher. Doug, so is, that's you? Sorry, I'm, I'm not going to say your full name. Thank you so much for the $10 donation. This is crazy. I got more donations today than I got in the past few months. You guys are crazy. Thank you so much. Show Punisher some love. That is awesome. Thank you so much, Punisher. This is for you, right there. Money, 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 money. Money. That, 
for your donation. You rock! Thank you so much, Punisher. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you, guys. Uh, this is amazing. Crazy, crazy times. Thank you so much. It is true. You rock. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Chad, whole four pro, trying everything to get. Sniper 7 and Marlin. That's ambitious. In pro, that is very ambitious. Well, uh, props to your opponent, Chad. Props to your opponent. Oh, thank you, Punisher. I really appreciate it. What a crazy stream. Oh, thank you, Bob. Thank you, guys. You are amazing, all of you. We just have the best people in this channel. Uh, I'm not lying. I mean that. We have just such a great group. I really love it. Hussein Ali. Sorry, did I miss something, Hussein? Did I miss something? Sorry, chat has been blowing up. Hi, two par. Did you get two pars, Hussein? So what was your score? How did your run go, Hussein? You just said two par, or did I miss anything else? Oh, Agab, thank you. I really had a lot of fun today. It's not over, we have uh, four holes left to play. I'm glad you liked it, Agab. I really liked you. Uh, I'm really glad you liked it. I had a lot of fun too. I really did. Otherwise, I would not be doing this all day. <laughs> Three backspin, four right spin at the hole. Oh, wow. That's amazing. But ballsy move. I mean, sniper seven and pro, that is uh, courageous. <laughs> you love burnt toast or you love toast on fire? What's uh, what's it? Uh, what you con want to convey with the emojis, uh, Drew? Burn toast or toast on fire or both? So a lot of wind there. Uh, I'm gonna take a side spin off. I mean, yeah, we have to uh, get lucky here on this one. So I take side spin off and the wind also is going to make it hard to uh, get it, the ball to stop. So I'm going to take a uh, curl off as well. Yes, Jeffrey, I'm streaming uh, five pro accounts tomorrow. It's okay. We'll take this uh, as expected. I did not expect the ball to uh, stop on the, the green here. Uh, too much uh, wind and not enough backspin on my extra mile four, but uh, just going for eagle here is gonna be nice. Yeah, Mo, right? <laughs> Jay's watching and listening to the president. Does he have like a? Oh, you you can't hear. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, that's just bread without the fire, Drew. <laughs> Yeah, it's tough to judge though, very tough to judge this one with the uh, with the extra mile four. Oh, thank you, Mike Dilson. Doing the best I can to make it fun and entertaining entertainment and education. Both should be fun. First and foremost, I think it should be fun. Live streams should be uh, more about the fun than the actual game. But it helps if the game is there as well. So I cannot get complacent with my uh, Firefly. So I had to focus on that. We get the Eagle, nice. So we're on track for 28, but we need a few more drops. Starting with hole number seven. where I really, um, really played a crap shot earlier. 
I don't know what the scores are. We're gonna look at that later. First, we're gonna use our sniper. We're gonna switch to the Marlin. And in high winds, we're gonna switch to the season 21 ball. Oh, thank you, Agap. <laughs> you agree with Mike Dills. I love you guys, it's amazing. Let's not mess it up here. Honey big. Min plus 10, power zero ball. Oh, thank you so much, Kevin. I appreciate that a lot. That's uh, awesome. 3.7. You know what? Just type it. Type it in the chat. You know. You know. You know what I am. Okay, back here. Get the push. Get the, the kick forward right here. That's where we want to be. Kick forward. 1.9 is an adjustment of 1.6. Perfect. Can we get the kick we need? Get the kick, get the roll. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, wow. That's why I put the ball in there. Uh, the wind was kind of off, uh, on the cusp. Uh, the cusp of uh, what I wanted. It was not high wind. We could have played it with the Marlin, but uh, we need the shot. So um, that's why I... Uh, I'm not going to say wasted that ball, but I knew I had a better chance of dropping it with this ball. Then with the Marlin and a three ring adjustment. So, oh my goodness, this feels good. This feels good, guys. Thank you, McDilson. Thank you, A Gap. Thank you, Punisher. And thank you, Jeffrey. Thank you, Bob and Zilke. Peter. Thank you, KB. Thank you, Drew and random guy with no name. Thank you, Ginger Jordy. Thank you, Jay and Nick. <coughs> Thank you, Stefan and Mo, Mr. Magoo. Thank you, KB. It absolutely is. It absolutely is. Thank you and good luck, honey big. Exactly. It's not a waste if it goes in the hole. Thank you, Corey. Much appreciated. We got it. We got this so many times today. <sighs> Feels good. All right. 29 is leading, apparently. 29 is leading. And I said, I'm gonna go power three ball. I'm gonna go Kingmaker. It's the first Kingmaker I play in Rookie this week. I want power three for the second shot. So I'm not as much in... Um, on the cusp of overpower there. I'm gonna go for the rough pump again. <laughs> Thank you, Bob. The drama continues. Right, that's it. Let's get it. So, eagle, uh, a birdie eagle finish would be awesome for the 30. But an eagle eagle finish would be even more awesome. <laughs> so that's why I'm using the uh, Kingmaker here. <coughs> wind, re wind resistance for the second shot. And distance for the second shot. We were, because we were too close for comfort there earlier. Uh, we had to adjust into overpower. Which is never ever uh, a very good idea. I knew that was going to be a tricky shot. But I had to play it, because that's how we dropped it all week. And I didn't want to give up on that. We had a nice adjustment, and I want to keep it that way. So we hit perfect, so now... 
I mean, we have plenty of Kingmakers and uh, we're gonna win some Kingmakers. Stop right there. Nice. Nice 205. Uh, 308, F5. 308 is good. I'll take that. We're gonna get more Kingmakers out of this tourney than we'll uh, have played. That first one and only Kingmaker we're gonna play in Rookie. And um, we're gonna be top 3 for sure here. So we're gonna get some Kingmakers. But I feel the Kingmaker here is necessary. Power 3 ball. Power 2 ball was not enough. To have a comfortable adjustment for the second shot. So it all depends on the wind now for the second shot. It's gonna be short. Okay. Focus. Oh, we are just, you see, perfect. We are in max distance here. And this is going to be good. Uh, that was my mistake earlier. This ball guideline is shite. So I thought it was short, but yeah, no, this is a... Uh, this is a backbone seven, meaning its precision is not, not, not great. We hit the perfect. We're gonna give ourselves a sh chance here. Come on, hop in. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry, but okay. We gave it a chance. Still too hot. It's treacherous, that ball guideline. It really, really is. <laughs> it's it's better, KB. It's better. It's pretty much the same, but uh, I think it sounds uh, it sounds better. <laughs> I was too hot anyway. It would not have gone in. This would not have gone in unless we hit the unless we hit the pin dead on and it drops dead. Otherwise, this would have. Uh, jumped out anyway okay I believe that we will not go for uh, Eagle uh, for Albi we're not gonna go for Albi on 9 what do you guys think 30 under is gonna be enough on the in this bracket I mean it's gonna be enough to have the lead for now but uh, I think 30 is gonna be enough We came in first, so we came in first. I think a 31 would win 100% of the time in this bracket. So now is the question, what are we gonna do? Who's the guy who came in? No, that's not the guy. No, 25. I'm just gonna check those guys out uh, because there were some guys with good scores. I think they have not played yet. So now we really have to make a decision. Yeah, he had a 30 under. He had a 30 under. If he can catch us, I would feel much better uh, with a 31 against this one. I'm not sure if it's enough. I'm just thinking out loud. I'm just thinking out loud, guys. Just thinking out loud. We have a Guardian uh, 4. Could we go with the Guardian 4? <laughs> go green. <laughs> Punisher, you're... That's so funny. I mean, we could play... A power five ball. I know, Corey. We could use a power five ball. 
Let me just think about this for a second. Looks good, right? We haven't uh, played one yet. Looks so good. Wouldn't that be a nice way to finish? Dropping the Albi with the rock and roll ball. I think we can play that. Come on, let's try this. Let's end this with a bang. One way or another. <laughs> Same setup as with the big dog. Exactly right. But I don't have... Uh, play safe Alba. Yeah, that's right. Okay, um... I don't even know if we need a power 5 ball, uh, to be honest. We could, a uh, power 3 ball will be enough. Do we have a power 4 ball? I don't think we do. What's this? Uh, 3 with wind resistance. Uh, that could also be interesting. Let me just check my big dog stats. Um, what did we play? Big dog five. Oh, that's 177, so we are lacking six yards. Hey, Anna, welcome. <laughs> I'm facing a dilemma here. Yeah, just no birdie, right? No, you know what? Guardian power five ball. Let's give it our all. Katana on nine and pro. Wow, KB, awesome. But we don't have the distance with our second club. Okay, it's decided. It's done. It's gonna be too late. It's too late now. Let's do... Yeah, exactly. Rock and roll finale. Rock and roll finale. Knowing full well that the 29 will also have us in the lead for now. I'm a little bit tense, guys. I don't know if you can see that. The big finale, one way or another. We're gonna go out. We're gonna end the day with a bang. Either a good one or a bad one. <laughs> good bang or bad bang? Which is it gonna be? Yeah, Drew, right? The rock and roll finale. And that's why we're gonna change to toast it. Here we go. <laughs> Your chance, Jay. <laughs> Let's make this a stream fun. So we gotta set it up the same. Uh, the same as with a power 3 ball here. Gonna play it exactly the same. So I don't need the max distance. A great left. Should be okay. I messed this one up right off the bat. Come on. This is the first time I hit a great left on this hole all day. Was it the tenseness? Hey, if we get the LB now, uh, we are having a lot. I mean, we have we are just missing too many yards here. Too many yards. Too many yards. We have no topspin. Uh, now I just have to go for Eagle. I'm sorry guys, I failed you. I failed you. I wanted too much and I failed you. So I really need to get it to the green now. Come on Chumley. The best thing would be for him to drop this. Just get an insane lucky Albi here. So I can have a freebie. Uh, not gonna happen. Still an okay shot from him. Okay, let's see. I have no idea what the yardage is here. We are too far to the left. We have a lot of distance to cover here. I think uh, we should be fine. 
We have to use. We have to use uh, topspin here. We don't have much. I could go over, full overpower. 4.8 rings. It's going to be 3.4 rings. I'm going to go with backspin, guys. No, I'm not. It's too dangerous. Too dangerous. <sighs> this is not it. No, I don't like the look of this. Okay. Would have been so cool. I messed it up. But we are not done yet. We can save this. We can save this. I should have hit a great right, but what do you know? Nope. What a shame. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Prime time for save and I cannot deliver, guys. I am sorry. But you know what? It was a lot of fun this round. It was a lot of fun and I just wanted too much here. I don't regret, uh, regret going for it. I feel maybe a 30 would have been enough. I'm not sure. Um, but the 31 would have been very safe. Uh, we are the clubhouse leader. That's the thing that counts most. Oh, we have five more uh, rounds to play tomorrow in pro, so... Oh, thank you, Kevin. Thank you, uh, everyone. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, everyone. Thank you. I really appreciate it a lot. 29 under. Jimima, we did not really repeat our magic from the opening round, the 32. But 29 with a 32 tiebreaker is uh, is nice. The other guy who shot 30 under, uh, he has to repeat his round. Maybe he's choking as well. So, and if we don't win gold, we don't win gold. So, but I, I thought uh, it would be a fun way to finish this. It's still okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not, I'm not disappointed at all. We had a lot of fun this round. A lot of uh, a lot of cool drops. Um, especially hole one, getting it twice was fun. Uh, very close looks on five. No, I'm happy. I'm happy. Thank you all for your time today. You've been hanging out all day. Some of you uh, have been hanging out for hours. I appreciate that a lot. So, thank you so much. I'm going to see you in uh, Ian and Dan's stream, probably. So, I hope to see you tomorrow. You take care. Have a great day. Uh, good luck in your rounds. And see you very, very soon. Thank you all. Bye-bye, guys.